So with this video, I'm just going to talk a bit more about this um, oscillator that I made that I was using with the sequencer in the last video. Um, it is basically the super simple oscillator from Look Mum No Computer, his uh, YouTube video. But in order to run this oscillator on 9 volts instead of the 12 volts that's the one in his video, so he's using the 3904 transistor and that will only oscillate at 12 volts. Um, I run 9 volts on all these guitar pedals at the moment so in order to do that you need to use the uh, 9018, I think it's an SS9018 transistor and they're weird transistors, they're kind of smaller than normal transistors um, but I got a bag of them here because I'm thinking of making 10 of these um, oscillators. Um, now it basically is that transistor, a green LED, and two resistors, and a capacitor. Now what I've got here, I've got a capacitor, I've got two capacitors on a switch. So this is an on, off, on switch. So when it's off, it's off, and then when it's on, it's on a 2.2 uh, NF capacitor. And when it's on the other side, it's on a 4.7 NF capacitor and that's because you get different pitches in um, so you can switch between a higher pitch oscillator or a lower pitch oscillator depending on what you want um, for your for the whatever you're doing um, and then it's got potentiometer which is I think it's a 10k potentiometer I think you can use 25k as well um, and then obviously I've got this um, Vactrol CV input output that goes to the sequencer. I'm not going to use that just right now because I'm just going to demonstrate as to what this is actually doing. Um, so the pot will, when you move that, that uh, di dictates the frequency and then the switch changes between whether you want it high pitch or low pitch. So I'll just go through that now. It's just hooked up to an orange micro dark and a 4x12 Marshall. I've also got a Korg MS20 filter because it sounds good through that. So the moment it is off, then I'm going to put on the uh, the higher frequency first. frequency on I actually got that in the wrong order that was actually the higher frequency and this is the lower frequency That's the lowest it'll go, and this is the highest it'll go. So it's got quite a good range on it. So before I put this together, I went through a lot of capacitors and found out which one was uh, I was happy with being the high and the low. So it's almost like a bass pitch and a higher pitch and also these are going to be good when I come to sequence like different things because I've got a good range of, of different um, you know different notes that I can different frequencies that I can uh, sequence for different compositions so all in all it's quite a good little oscillator I'm gonna put this it's on Vero at the moment I'm just gonna put this down onto an actual circuit that I've drawn myself I'm going to put it in this mini box as well. So I'm going to have um, audio out jack and then a CV jack on here so that I can just have this as an oscillator and it can go straight in um, to this, this bigger sequencer here. You know, just like that, it's very small. Um, so I'm going to get cracking and, uh, you know, build this thing up into its own standalone oscillator in this mini box, aluminium box. I'm going to etch the box um, and I'm going to make it look good and then... Unfortunately what's happening is um, 
the CV out isn't working too well. So it was working, but then when I put it in the box, it shorts out. So it's obviously the um, the grounds are there's something wrong with the grounding on, on this um, to make the CV work. But eventually it does work. But I just want to show what it sounds like just boxed up with this um, Korg MS20 filter. So I'll start the off position. This is the lower frequency, I think. Yeah, this is the lower frequency. This is me making my um, first like little product of a oscillator. Um, this is a very quick and dirty prototype of it. I should have it all sorted and fixed up soon. Um, when I start doing gigs, I'm going to sell these on my merch stand. And um, yeah, there you go. Cheers for watching.